there are several root causes that we can look at. Um, if we have a young man that grew up in a home where there was domestic violence, he watched his mom be emotionally or physically abused, um, if that is your first example of what a relationship is, um, you're going to grow up and mimic that same thing that you've seen in that household and same thing for young girls. If you saw that your mom was put down um, or physically abused, then you correlate that to that's what a relationship is and that's right, what love that's is. People will think that domestic violence is an anger issue and will oftentimes say we all get angry. Uh, we're angry at our bosses, but we don't call our bosses out of their names. We don't put our hands on our bosses. There is that self-control. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. So it's not an anger issue. It's very intentional that you're intimidating someone, isolating someone, threatening someone, physically, economically abusing them. Uh, also another misconception is that alcohol and drugs are the cause of domestic violence. Right. Um, and that's not the case either. One in three women have been victims of domestic violence. And that's a really staggering statistic because there's three of us on stage. And it's like if you're just in a crowded room, you can just count off one, two, three, and then likely every um, multiple of three is someone who is potentially a uh, victim of abuse.